What the fuck kind of title is this? Hello and welcome everyone, Dude Manage Down 3 here, slash DM20000, and welcome to a brand new MLP Let's Play of Super Lesbian Horse RPG Preemptive Game of the Year Edition. Yeah, that title is just astonishing. Marvelous, even. Alright. Let me preface the video by saying this. Before I was part of the Brony community, I used to watch this YouTube channel known as Pony Pokey. They made an abridged series, and they made watches of G3 My Little Pony Friendship is Ma- Not Friendship is Magic, just G3 MLP. That's all it's known by. And I really enjoyed all their videos, and they're, they're pretty funny. Um, I believe all three of them, they're named Bobby, Derek, and... Uh, Jake. And apparently they haven't been making the videos, I don't know what happened to them. I know what Bobby's been doing, he's been doing this. He's been making this game, and I assume that the other two are lost to the monster mythical beast known as College. So, this is a finished game, so let's get right to it. Horse time! Alright, how do I play this game? Toggle window size, I'll probably be changing quality later. Switch characters, Q and W. Run with shift, Z interact. Uh, okay, cool. Uh, press the select button to get this show on the road. Oh, okay, let's play this game. Fluttershy's bedroom. Uh, okay. I see a... I see a picture of Dash. Can I make out with the phone? Can I make out with the... <laughs> Wait, how do I get out of this? Oh, okay. Can I make out with the picture? <laughs> My limited edition autographed Rainbow Dash picture. It's number one of six. Do I need to collect them all? Oh, wait, should I speak like Fluttershy? <laughs> Rainbow gave everyone a poster like this last year for Horse Christmas. Then she said, she then said it was a joke. But Applejack said that was just damage control. I'm the only one who actually hung theirs up for, well, obvious reasons. Yeah, obvious reasons. If you want, <laughs> judging from the title, this is a shipping game. This is a green screen where I shoot answers for my big hit ask blog, re Fluttershy replies. Very popular on the internet, you know? Yeah, very popular. <laughs> the internet is a scary place, in the immortal words of my favorite philosopher. There's some stuff on the internet that is really bad, little B. Thanks, Bobby. Thanks, Bobby. I have a nice view of the lake from up here. Oh, I can see the fish flashing from... Run from up here. Hello, fishy friends. I'd wait, but they probably won't notice me. They're very busy fish. Indeed. Apparently there's internet in Equestria, I think. Whoops, I left my laptop over on overnight. I guess I might as well check my messages on Tumblr. Maybe I got some good questions to answer. Now let's see. Five people asking for hugs. Delete. <laughs> One person saying my ears are weird. That's not nice. Delete. Three people asking how I got so cute. Delete. Two homophobes. Delete. One R-rated question that I can't answer. Delete. Three very strange ponies that I probably should be worried about. Delete. Two people asking what Rainbow and I do for fun. Delete. And one nice question about animals that I might actually answer. But I think I'll save that question for tomorrow. Indeed. I never been on Tumblr. Like I have a Tumblr account, but I never use it. Let's see what's on my to-do list. Well, my New Year's resolutions are still here. I'm making good progress on a few of them, especially the funniest one. I haven't made quite as much progress on the get ripped one. Doesn't look like I have much to do today. How nice. I guess that means I get to take the day off. Oh, I know. I should make time with Dashy. I've been so busy lately that we haven't had a chance to spend a whole day together in weeks. I really miss having her around lately. Yeah, I'm sure. Well, that settles it. I'll head over to Rainbow's place and see if she wants to do anything. I'm sure she'll think of something fun to do. Oh, fun. Fun. What's that say? DWM? It's my official DWM poster. 
Yep, that's all I have to say about the corner of the house. Great, great. Now even Bobby's mocking me. I don't even know what the fuck that is. Let's go. Oh yeah, Fluttershy's property. Oh hey Angel, can I kill you? Hi Angel, what's that you've got there? Oh, it's a note. Let's see here. Adventuring tips for beginners. Should I read this? Oh, I... This actually feels like an RPG. Cool. Give some advice. I can use some pointers before I head to town. You never know what could be out there. Let's see what it says here. Tip 1. You can save from anywhere on the map as long as you aren't in a fight or talking to someone. Remember to save often. Tip 2. Use your skills to your advantage. For instance, Fluttershy can heal herself and her friends. Just keep an eye on her MP meter since special abilities drains your MP. Tip 3. If you find new equipment, be sure to equip it from the menu. Won't do any good if you're not wearing it. Uh, okay, this is an RPG. I, I get it. Thanks for the tips. Yep, have a nice day doing whatever Angel Bunny does. I don't know, abusing animals, probably. What the f- what the fuck happened to Equestria? Jesus Christ! What the hell? When did this turn into Bastion? Alright, is there random encounters or am I going to be running into sprites on screen? Wait, is that a changeling? Howdy. Oh my goodness, it's some type of horrible monster! Then why are you so happy about it? What the f- <laughs> What the fuck? It's twisted as a slime! Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness! Go. Okay, Fluttershy, you can do this. You just have to hit him a few times and then he'll go away. And if you get hurt, you can heal yourself with first aid. Let's get this over with. Okay, um... Uh, Bobby likes Earthbound. So, I think this game is going to be inspired by that. Alright, my skills is first aid. Great. Yeah, this is kind of Earthbound-resque. Fight log... Oh, okay, cool. There, I punch him a couple times. Great, I, I'm just fighting Twist. I don't, I don't care even. Is there an auto fight? Oh, ten bits. Sweet treasure. There, go away. All right, on my adventure. Where am I going? Ponet Town. I mentioned Earthbound. Great game! Great game. Just saying. And yeah, they did label Fluttershy's College. Great job, Fluttershy! You're being noticed! <laughs> let's, let's go into town. Ponet Town. Okay, uh, bookstore! It's Twilight here. Books. Probably shouldn't bar to Twilight's house if I haven't been invited over. Yeah, with a town that with a house that's literally labeled book. <laughs> uh, shock. Sh uh, sh show. P. Smiley face. Bits. We ain't ready yet. Come back tomorrow for the official grand opening. Did you find your cutie mark in shopping, or are you trying to get it? <gasps> Rarity. Hey, what's up? Oh, you. Hi, Rarity. How you been lately? Oh, Fluttershy, I'm doing well. I was hoping I'd see you today, though. It feels like I, we haven't spoken in ages. I suppose you're looking for Rainbow Dash right now. We can continue this conversation later. How'd you know I was looking for Rainbow? Darling, you're always thinking about Rainbow Dash. Mmm, -hmm, if you know what I mean. <laughs> you're thinking about it right now, aren't you? What if I snap out of it? I don't even know why I'm wasting my breath right now. You can't hear a word I'm saying as long as you're thinking about her. Fluttershy, where are you going? Don't just walk away from... Oh, rainbow. Rainbow. Rainbows. 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 <laughs> Alright, where's Rainbow Dash? We need to... We need to satisfy her her dreams and wow rainbow dash you live in a real shitty place even I have two floors hey oh I mean uh hey babe how's it hanging the fuck rainbow you don't have to hide your enthusiasm I think it's nice well I was just excited because I haven't seen you in ages 
I miss hanging out with you, you know. I know, I miss you too. I'm so sorry, Rainbow. I just couldn't leave my poor little animal friends this past th these past two weeks. Mr. Bear got sick and then Froggy the Frog caught what Mr. Bear had somehow and I don't even know how Froggy the Frog caught it since he's an amphibian and before I knew it, half my animals were sick. Snowball effect, I guess. That sounds pretty awful. Yeah, but thanks to me, they're all better now. And that means I finally had the day off. I was hoping you'd have something in mind for the two of us to do together. Yeah, do. There, there's a bed right there, and a couch, and the floor. You mean like kiss- <coughs> <laughs> Hey, hey, audience interaction! What should I pick? Heck yeah, or heck yeah! Or heck yeah! <laughs> yeah? That's a- that's a word? Uh, well, I can't hear you right now. Uh, sure, let's make out, I guess. What the fuck? <laughs> uh, what is this, Mario RPG? <laughs> that kind of reminded me of Mario RPG a bit. Like that, the moment when they were in the wedding chapel. I've got a better idea. What? Let's go on a day. You mean right now? Yeah, why not let's do something fun? Why aren't there no punctuation there? Well, okay, but just calling it a date doesn't exactly give us anything in particular to do, dear. You don't say dear. You sh that's Rarity's job. I don't know. I'll feel sure something out. Let's just wander around and find something to do, I guess. Your girlfriend Rainbow Dash joined you! Yeah! If you consider that a victory. Alright, so, yeah, we do walk around. Cool. Oh, that town. Hey, Rarity, I want to talk to you again. Oh, Rainbow Dash, can we speak for a moment? Sure, Rarity, what's up? It's about the dress commission you were interested in. New dress? What's the occasion, Rainbow? Are you getting married? Oh, actually, it's for you. Surprise. Confetti everywhere. <sighs> for me? Oh, you shouldn't have- Oh, no, no surprises here, I'm afraid. What do you mean? I've been thinking about your request ever since you spoke to to me about it the other day. You gave me quite the ethical dilemma, Rainbow. Ethical dilemma? I'm afraid I can't do it. I simply can't bring myself to commit those crimes for, against fashion. Sorry, Rainbow. <laughs> oh, come on! My idea was great and you know it! Did you learn anything? Rainbow, please, just think about your request. A black dress with photorealistic flame pattern? Really? What is this, fifth grade? Hey, clothes with flame on them have been proven to make you go faster and be more hardcore! Yeah, hardcore. Mmm. Mmm. That's a psychological fact. If Twilight was here, she could back me up on this, but she's not, so you'll just have to take my word for it. Photoshop, don't you want to be fast? I, uh, don't crush this poor girl's dreams, Rarity. Where did you learn such a ridiculous thing, anyway? I learned that psychological fact from, uh, from my uncle. Yeah, my uncle. Good old psychologi psychology dash. I have a very wide family. Rainbow, you don't have any uncles. Your dad was a... S <laughs> was an only child. Fluttershy, cut me some slack. I'm trying to get you a sick dress here. It's okay, Rainbow. At least you tried, right? Okay, Rarity. What if we reworked the design a little? What if we replaced the fire pattern with lightning? I'm still not sewing that. <clears throat> I'm still not sewing that. Okay, fine! I guess it's back to the drawing board! Uh, do I have to actually work on that dress? Is, is this going to be a model plot from Suited for Success? Look, Rainbow, it's the wishing well! Um... Did you hear that? It sounded like it was coming from my basement. Your base? You have a basement? Oh, oh. Um... Okay. To the basement. What the fuck?! How'd you have access to the universe in your basement, Rainbow Dash?! Hi, Twilight. Twilight what? Yeah, yeah, just, just that line. Twilight what? Why don't you get in my basement? 
And why does my basement look like a dungeon all of a sudden? How and when I got here isn't important. The point is your basement is a neato dungeon now. Oh dear. Why would you do this? I had cool stuff down here! Now I see a slime. With power tools and whatnot! Just because you're the princess of town doesn't mean you can royally screw up my basement! Does she have wings? But it's better now! Yeah, totally. I can see the cosmics. It is a better basement. You see, as the princess of friendship, I have a duty to teach everyone valuable lessons about interpersonal relationships. Totally. And I made this dungeon! And Rainbows is the only house in Ponette with a basement, so this was the easiest place to start building it. And now we get to explore it! Together! As best friends! Well, one of you more is friends, but it'll be great! What? That doesn't sound like fun at all. That sounds scary and stressful. Exactly! Twilight, I don't think you have a firm grasp on the concept of friendship yet. It'll be a bonding experience! How about I bond my right hook with your... Rainbow, please, don't get violent. Come on, I'll make out with you later. Sorry, babe. I was waiting for the rest of our friends to get here first, but you know what? We can handle this on our own. It'll be just the three of us on our own fun-filled and dungeon adventure still not sure this is safe come on what's the worst that could happen we die twilight dooms the universe <laughs> you're not gonna let us turn down your offer are you twilight nope you know we were kind of on a date or whatever more or less do you really want to be a third wheel twilight um, I feel really okay with that. Uh, did you ship Twilight with someone? Who? I, I, I'm questioning who. I'm thinking of the options here. And I can only think of one. Twilight Sparkle joined your party as the third wheel. Yeah! Okay, but fair warning, I could start macking on my girl at any time. It's not like you... It's not like you two haven't gone all affectionate around me before. Honestly, it's no big deal. Oh my god, Twilight's a watcher! Like, really going to town. She's primarily driven by impulse. It can happen with, and will happen when you least expect it, Twilight. Whatever floats your love boat. <laughs> I identify with Twilight here. Some real hardcore tonsil hockey if you catch my ow you two are making a much bigger deal out of it than I ever would so just just so you know can we go swap and spit I get it rainbow glad to get big smacker okay smooching face sucking locking lips fuckering up watching submarine races can we just go already? Yes, let's go. Let's go into first. Let's go into combat mode. Oh no, more twisted goose. <gasps> Gasp! All right, so I can choose the text for each of the characters. What can Twilight do? You're a princess. You can do many things. Scorch. All right. All right, Rainbow. What can you do? Oh, whatever. <laughs> Wait, do I have to? How does this work? Oh, I have to go in order. Oh. Yeah, oh. Okay, uh. What do you kiss. Give Fluttershy a little peck on the cheese to boost morale and raise all their stats by 15 for 5 turn. Okay, after this, I need a glass of water. What the f. I didn't choose. To oh, whatever. And why is it a picture of Dracula? Fight, sure. It tends to kiss. Great. Infatuate. Wow, that is Earthbound esque. Cool. I'm okay with that. Okay. Uh. Alright. 
Alright, Fluttershy, you have been infatuated, which means you are now superpowered. Whoa! Wait. She can double hit? Cool. I kicked so many things. <laughs> can I just say this right now? This this game is awesome. I may not be a shipper, but this is hilarious. Well, hey, we found some stuff. Yeah. We found some awesome stuff. God damn, this is awesome. I can see the universe. <laughs> Alright, I think this would be a good place to stop. Alright, I'm gonna save the game because I can save anywhere. Let's save it. File, I don't know, 16. Save. There we go. Alright, so, that's it for me from Super Lesbian Horse RPG. Next time on Super Lesbian Horse RPG, because that's the best name that I've ever heard. We're gonna continue going through Rainbow Dash's basement with, uh, apparently Fluttershy and Rainbow being mates and... Uh... <laughs> Just, you know who I am.